Hello, hello, hello. Thank you guys so much for tuning into Dollar Tree haul number 84. I found some amazing finds this week, some brand new finds again. So I am super excited to show you guys. And I also have one thing that I wanted to do a quick Dollar Tree product review really quick. So let's go ahead and just hop on into it. So this is the fruit scented lip balm. If you guys have been seeing these, they also have a strawberry and they also have a lime. So opening it, opening it up, this is what it looks like here. And it was a little hard to get open at first. I was like righty tighty, lefty loosey. It just took a while. But this is how it looks on the inside. And it smells exactly like a lemon with just a little bit of a little bit of like a fruity. I don't know how to it per, I don't know how to describe it, but it does smell like lemon with like a little bit of perfuminess added to it. But it's not an overpowering, overbearing smell. It smells really, really good. So I actually have it on my lips now. And I wanted to put it on maybe five or ten minutes before I started the video because I want to see like how long is this gonna last? Because the last one I tried from the Dollar Tree, it was the one in the little it was shaped like lips. That sucked. Like it didn't last at all. But this has been on my lips for about a good maybe 10 minutes so far. And it kind of has a little hue to it. I don't know if that's because of the fact that I do I did have like some foundation on my lips prior to me putting this on. So it is pretty good. I don't have any complaints. I'm I really really like it it has like a really thick consistency it's not like watery or or waxy or anything like that it's pretty good so for me to have it on for 10 minutes and it, my lips are still I would say that I would say that that's good so pretty good if you ask me so again this is a green briar product so this is actually a Dollar Tree product so this is pretty good. So if you guys see this, it's definitely worth picking up and giving a try. So the first one that I found is the Pita Sea Salt. Guys, this is a regular size box. This is a 9.5 ounce box. If you guys look on, just type this in on Google. They have these at Target, Walmart, all the regular stores for $2.99 and up. So to get it at the Dollar Tree, you guys, is a definite steal. I actually have been eating these with some spinach artichoke dip and as you guys can see this box is almost gone I'll probably finish this box off today but these are really really good it's sea salt definitely pick these up if you guys see them and I also got two flatbread Italian herb again these are 9.5 ounce boxes as well this one I already opened up because I wanted to try it out it is pretty good so I decided to go ahead and pick up Two. One I picked up one day and then when I went back I said you know what I might want to pick up another box. So yeah and the good thing about it is that these do not expire until January 5th 2017. So I still have another month another month and a half to eat these and trust me with my large family these will be way gone before January the next one I picked up this is the flip side pretzel crackers and this is the one that I saw that was haul I haven't seen any any other any other crackers that I showed haul but once I seen these I like I have to find these because I got these couponing a while back and I really like them so it is a basically a cracker on one side and a pretzel on the other side and again, 9.5 ounces. This is Keebler Townhouse Crackers, you guys. Definitely got to pick these up if you see them. And I found another one, you guys. This, I'm not even going to try to pronounce it. But this is Tuscan Cheese. And I definitely should have got two of these. So if I see these again, I'm definitely going to be stocking up. Okay, guys. So next item is the socks. You guys know I love Dollar Tree socks. And if you guys are new to my channel... I love Dollar Tree socks. This is the one with emoji. I love anything with emoji on it, you guys. So this is what it looks like. This is a women's sock size 9 to 11. And it's got the money emoji and one hundred all over it. But this is the Captain Crunch touchdown. And last time I went to Dollar Tree, I picked up two boxes. So I said, you know what, Tab? You might want to just go and pick up a third. So this is a 13-ounce box. And this one doesn't expire until March 2017. So these are going to last a little bit longer. But I was super, super excited. Captain Crunch, like I said, in my local, dollar, in my local grocery store is at least $3 and up. 
three dollars for a box of cereal is ridiculous so yeah to get it for a buck yeah next find is i found some cheese nips by nabisco this is a seven ounce box and this does not expire until march 17th 2017 so i'm pretty this is one reason i like to guess why things come to the dollar tree so this is one reason why as i figured they're gonna they're about to basically expire soon you know what i mean because because if you go to the grocery store and get a box of these i'm pretty sure the expiration date is probably maybe six to nine months out so the fact that these expire in March, that's that's what I'm guessing. A lot of times is these brands will update their packaging. That's a lot of reasons why they make it to Dollar Tree. So yeah, I just like to guess. But what do you guys think? But that's why I think they made it to Dollar Tree. Okay, guys. So the next thing that I found is the Nasalub Saline Spray. Now, I did look this up. And this retails for $4.97 at Walmart. And this bad boy here does not expire until January 2018. So I have over a year to use this. Now, this is supposed to be a non-medicated relief for dry or stuffy noses. So I've got kids with allergies right now. My older daughter has allergies, Paris. And I just decided, you know what, let me get this for her. I have heard lots of good reviews on this. I did some research on my own and a lot I haven't heard any negative reviews so far on this product. So I said, let me just go ahead and try it. This is a gentle cleanser and moisturizer. Let's just go ahead and open up the box. But this is how the actual packaging looks. So hopefully this helps and works for those dry stuffy noses cuz you know winter time is fastly approaching. Okay guys, so the next find is, and I think I saw this coffee cup on my Makeup Room Diva's Instagram, and I kept a mental note of it, so I found this when I went to the Dollar Tree, and it says Hug Me, it's the, got the Mickey Mouse hands. Now I tried to do some research on this to see how much this would retail for, and when I went to the, this brand here, the Zach website, a lot of their cups retail for $5.99 so I just went with that so $5.99 for a coffee cup <laughs> so I went ahead and just got this one so I'm so happy I can add this to my little collection it's super cute next thing I found this is something new this is the Progresso artichoke hearts now I should have picked up more but I was on a budget so if I see any when I go back next week then I will get some because I was I was under a budget you guys so this does have an expiration date May 10th 2017 so I have plenty of time to use these when I very first saw this my my first thought was spinach and artichoke dip so I will definitely be making that using these so if I do make it and I can get all of the maybe ingredients from the Dollar Tree I don't think I can't get spinach from the Dollar Tree I don't think but yeah, I will definitely keep you guys updated. A lot of you guys have been finding the Kylie the Kylie collection that she did with Sinful Colors, the fingernail polish. So I found two of them. If you guys want to know, because they mix them in with the LA Colors nail polishes. So when you guys are hunting, just look at the top because the top will have SC for Sinful Colors, LAC for LA Colors, or um, what's the other one that we bought? OPI. It will have OPI on it if you guys are looking for OPI. So don't bother looking through all the colors. Just look at the top. Look at the tops. And another way to find the Kylie one is because it says Kylie all over the, the top. So no way you can miss that. But this is the color Commotion. I'm trying to get a few more nail polishes because a few of them I had to throw out because they just got really old and nasty. Y'all know how them fingernail polishes can get. And the next one I found is called Cashmere. And of course, Commotion and Cashmere start with a K. So this is a very, it's like a really light lavender color. And then it looked like it's got some kind of iridescent shimmer or something in it. But it's really, really pretty, you guys. Okay, hey guys, I'm going to speed it up because my battery is about to die. I found this Justin Bieber singing toothbrush. I saw this on Pretty and Flaw's channel. I'm going to save this for my daughter and hopefully when she behaves, then she can get this. I found a bunch of new stickers, you guys. So you guys know I love emoji. I had to get these. These are the pop-up stickers. 108 come in here. They're like foily, shiny. Love it. 
Love it, love it. Some animal stickers by Jap. This is a 10 count. How pretty are these, you guys? Love it, love it, love it. Got some more animal stickers. This is an 11 count. Love it. Owls, y'all know I love owls. This is a 10 count. I had to get it. How cute are these? I love the tree, and the tree is one whole sticker. You guys know I love 3D. And I saw these cute little frogs, so I had to get them. I just love all the animal stickers. I just have to get them all. Got some cute little fishies. How cute. Love the 3D. And last but not least, I got the monkeys. How cute that was everything that I found. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll check you guys out in the next video. Bye!